Well, sociology, there's people get confused with psychology often because they both sound pretty similar and it's kind of the same subject matter in the same time, but sociology examines the macrocosm whereas psychology like, examines the lower individual level. And it's sometimes better to learn on the higher level first so you can understand better how people react in a group and you can better also interact with your own society once you learn what the reasons that why sometimes people interact the way they do. It's, it's just real neat how in sociology you just you think a different way and you learn cultural contents that you were not used to such as one of the students being non-traditional coming out of the Navy from 22 years how he views life compared to me uh, who was 19 at the time straight out of high school and how I viewed my life and it's, just, it's opened the door for me to you know see things from other people's point of views that I never had until I took sociology. Well, sociology has opened the door for me. Uh, it really makes you step outside your normal, your norms, and makes you reflect on what makes you you. But then, what makes everybody who they are and makes us interact better? I mean, in my class, I had to break a norm. I ended up wearing a dress at a very well-established restaurant locally, and. Uh, you know, just finding out how people would react to something different, and it's just amazing how, you know, similar we are and how breaking just one small thing such as dress code can throw everybody off.